Hey, Jonathan here with Blogging Your Passion and wanted to create a quick video just showing you some of the highlights of the Keyword Winner WordPress plugin. I've been using it for a few days now and I have enjoyed the results. I think this is a great tool for bloggers that are just getting started. Uh, if you are more advanced and you can tackle something a little bit more robust, I would still recommend the Keyword Strategy tool at keywordstrategy.org but this keyword winner is really going to help most of you that are just having a difficult time dealing with um, finding keywords so I'm on a site where I receive guest post and somebody has written a, a post about Chevy engines so what I'm going to do is just walk you through some of the specifics about how I've been using the tool so the first thing I do is I just get like a base keyword. So this is the topic of what it's going to be about. And right here it says get keyword winner suggestion. So I'm going to click on that. And the keyword winner brings back some results here. And they are coded red and they say this is orange, kind of looks yellow to me, but it's classified red, orange, and green. And this is based on this competition factor which you've heard me say in the past on the blog that that's a, one of the determining factors of choosing the right keywords. There's several different ones, but you know, if you just basically find keywords that have low competition, you do have a better overall chance at ranking. So you see here, if I were to go with used engines or engines for sale, or even just Chevy engines like I originally wanted to, I've got 922,000 competing pages. It's going to be a little bit difficult to try to rank for that right away without a lot of backlinks and a lot of promotion to that page. So if I just keep scrolling down, I can get down here into these green ones, and these are ideal. Doesn't mean you can't go after some of the yellow if you really want to, you can definitely do that and over time or the fact that you have a strong site that's aged, you might be able to get some results. But to keep it simple, here's a great example. Uh, used Chevy engines, it's only got 19,000 total competition. I won't go into all these other figures right now. This is the most important of them all. So it's got pretty low competition. So I'm going to choose that and what I could do is just click on that and it immediately plugs it in up here. Now I could add and make it more robust, but to keep it simple, that's just what I'm going to call it. I'm also going to edit my permalink because I want to make sure it uses that title. So I'm just going to have it say used Chevy engines. And then another cool feature is that you can use some of these as tags. So I can grab this one as a tag. Each time you click on one, it, it scrolls it down to show you it's been added. So it adds all those tags automatically. I wouldn't get too crazy with tags, but maybe your green ones you can use for tags. Now another uh, feature, I don't use it a whole lot, but if you click on this uh, insert all keywords, then this button will actually take those keywords above and insert them into your text. And the idea here is when you're creating your article, you can begin to work some of these into your um, text. But really what I like to do is take my main phrase, use Chevy engines, and work that in two or three times into the text. So I'm not going to take too much time to do that right now so we can keep moving through here. Um, then the next one is if you scroll down you'll find the keyword meta and what's really cool about this feature is all you have to do is click on the empty space and it all shows up in here for you and this is what shows up in the search engines. So once I've done that I can choose to add a cool picture if I want or I can just simply choose to hit publish and when I do that, then I've got an optimized post for used Chevy engines. And I know it's got low competition. I've optimized it in my post. It's in my URL. It's in my, my title tag for my title. And it's in my tags. And it's also here in uh, the meta information. So that's how you can really begin to optimize this. So I'd encourage you to definitely give this a shot and uh, purchase this, begin using it. You can always get a refund if it doesn't work for you, but it's an easy way for you to begin to use keywords, good keywords, when you're writing your post.